Morning all. Uh, day 20 post op. Um, I think on, on yesterday's post, although I was concentrating on uh, the exercise philosophy, um, I didn't have much to say about symptoms, etc. Um, most because I, would, I said there was no real progress to report, but I think it will probably be just as, if not more, helpful for anyone looking in on this to be aware of uh, uh, what symptoms are still presenting or what's potentially not going too well. Um, I also had a, a little bit of a, well, I wouldn't go as far as saying a eureka moment last night, uh, but pulled a, a few things together, which um, may well be uh, be relevant or salient. Um, going back onto the, the symptoms, uh, I've still been a, a little bit sort of wobbly, both in mind and body over the last um, few days, despite some of the gains I've made uh, and improvements in, in the walking. Um, I've been a bit lazy and indisciplined with the crawling because my walking's improved so much. Um, I'm tending to walk around the house uh, without thinking about it. I need to get back to doing more crawling. Um, something which actually was um, a bit of progress that I didn't include was I was doing a couple of sessions of crawling down the stairs, uh, which presents a, a totally different coordination and stabilisation challenge. Uh, first time it was... You know, pretty air and scare them actually like I've got quite a quite a long and wide staircase um but the times after that there was quite a rapid improvement and I sort of carry over of that into me into my other stuff so um that was good oh the, the, I think I've probably touched on it before there's a whole variety of uh, of crawling techniques which are useful in in just um essentially improving um uh, your 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 crawling and also the the benefits that that has to offer. Um, so been a bit a bit wobbly. Uh, the double vision still hanging around. I, I thought it was almost um, almost good to go. Uh, as I'm sitting here on the uh, first floor of the house, uh, when looking to the distance, I um, well, I was going to say I, I see uh, single vision. I suppose to do with there's a little bit of a hint of double. If I lean my head over to the um, over to the left, as you can see there, like that, um, the it goes to single vision. Um, now that was was that's something that's been a little bit consistent, and it's also led me into um, what I, I sort of uh, feel I discovered last night. Uh, I'd spoken in one of the other blogs about. Um, me wife and daughter massaging me shoulders and neck and that number one improving me um uh me breathing and the problems with the diaphragm which have pretty much gone completely now um but also you know clearing uh making make me tightening up my mental acuity um and also the double vision going um when i had a little think about that last night induced from you know, the, you know thinking why would it improve in tilting the head um the the muscle that presented with the the, the most salient trigger point uh, um was uh levator scap uh, now that is a muscle that goes from cervical vertebrae one two three and four into the into the scapula now um Problems with uh, resolving in around either pressure or subluxation on C1 uh, are associated with double vision. Uh, they're also associated with constipation, which is something I've, uh, I've uh, been present with, though I don't think I've shared that one with you yet. Um, I, I don't think we need any stool shots just yet. Like I don't think any are ready for that one. Um, and also... Um, uh, the the nerve exits for the diaphragm are at C three four and five, um, and so I, I think given all of that and given that um, massage and removal of, of tension um, in a in a muscle like that, that um, has an origin at one one two three and four, uh, I, I reckon that's you know a, a little bit more an anecdotal. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to concentrate on that 
if, <laughs> if I can blag enough massages out of my wife and daughter, uh, I might have to dip my hand in my pocket and, and go, go professional on it. Um, and and see if it if it has any demonstrable uh, improvement on it. Um, let's think what else I um I can talk about. Um, I think that's probably um probably it for now. Um, I'll uh, I'll add a little bit more later if because uh, there's something kicking me in the back of the head here saying that I had something I wanted to put over, but. We'll see. Ta-da.